Good morning, good morning, good morning everybody. It is brilliant to be with you today and I am so very grateful for this opportunity to be able to hop up, seek wisdom, search for insight and study into the book of Proverbs and thank you so very much for holding me accountable to my habits, my, my disciplines. So welcome to this beautiful Monday the 26th of October 2020 and welcome to the Proverbs Challenge. And the Proverbs Challenge is very simple, it's very easy and takes no more than five minutes per day. The challenge is to simply read the proverb of today's date. There are 31 proverbs in the Bible, and so it fits perfectly within a month to search for knowledge and understanding and wisdom and insight. So the challenge for today would be read Proverbs 26, and if you would like to take it one step further, then choose just one verse out of Proverbs 26 and drop it in the comments below. Let me know which piece of wisdom has been put on your heart today. So as I was reading through Proverbs 26, I came across in various translations verse number 8 and I absolutely just settled on that one in my heart. So Proverbs 26 verse 8 says, As they that bind a stone in a sling, so are they that give honor to a fool. Right? So that's Proverbs 26 verse 8. As they that bind a stone in a sling, so are they that give honor to a fool. So as I read through that, there's two main ideas today, and they're saying the exact same thing, um, busy comparing situations to show us the same principle behind different situations. So the New Living Translation says, Honoring a fool is as foolish as tying a stone in a slingshot. All right, that's the New Living Translation. Honoring a fool is as foolish as tying a stone to a slingshot. So the two ideas that we're looking at, number one, is tying a stone into a slingshot. Right, so tying a stone into a slingshot is an unwise idea because as you release it, it was, it's tied into the sling, so it's going to rock it back around and smack you upside the head. So we know that tying a stone into a sling is an unwise idea. Right? And we compare that to the second half of the verse, which is about honoring a fool, which is praising or honoring or promoting one who is not deserving of the recognition, the acknowledgement or the responsibility. All right, so honoring a fool, giving to a fool, giving to an unwise person praise and honor has the exact same effect as tying a stone into a slingshot and rocketing it around to hit you upside the head again. All right, so honoring a fool is as foolish as tying a stone to a slingshot. Tying a stone to a slingshot and getting hit upside the head is an instant consequence. There's an instant payment for that ill wisdom. All right, but honoring a fool, promoting a fool in your organization or promoting one who is not ready for that responsibility, one who is unwise, that also has consequences, has the same consequences as being smacked by a stone, but it has different outcomes. It shows differently over time. But what Proverbs 26 verse 8 is telling me today is that unwisdom or ill wisdom is ill wisdom, no matter how much time is involved in it. So Proverbs 26 verse 8, as they that bind a stone in a sling, so are they that give honor to a fool. So please do drop in the comments below. Let me know which verse out of Proverbs 26 stands out for you. Let me know which piece of wisdom you are taking into your day with you today. For the rest, have an excellent and blessed day. Stay safe, stay sane, stay sensible, and stay studying. I'll see you tomorrow for more. Have a blessed week. Enjoy.